Hi everybody. Welcome to the answer the question series of intelligent patients. The main objective is to help to the intelligent engineers those who are preparing for the competitive examinations. And question of this week where you need to apply the intelligence. Question of this week on signals and systems. You have just two minutes time to answer this question. And question is the Laplace transform of causal signal y of t is y of s, s plus 2 whole divided by s plus 6. The value of the signal y of t at t is equal to 0 0.1 second is given in dash dash units. So you have just too much time to answer the question. Four options are given. One of the options is correct. Your time starts now. So what you need to do is that you need to use understanding of the system, signals and system. So I have any signal, I can have a causal signal, then I have, I have anti-causal signal and I have non-causal signal. So causal signal means at all time instances which are t less than 0, the signal value is 0. So basically, as far as causal system is concerned, because we have just two minutes time, we know that causal signal have 0 value for all time instances t less than 0. So causal signal, we can represent like this, something like this. This is suppose y of t. And this is time instance t. Here all time instances t less than 0. The signal value is 0. This is t greater than 0. So now let us try to use this. So what is given? Given system y of t is a signal. We wish to find out y of 0.1 and y of s is given, that is Laplace transform, which is s plus 2 divided by s plus 6. So, what I can do is that I can rearrange this s plus 6 minus 4 divided by s plus 6. This is equal to s plus 6 divided by s plus 6 minus 4 divided by s plus 6. So, I have y of s is equal to 1 minus 4 divided by s plus 6. Now quickly, if we wish to get the answer, then take a inverse Laplace transform of this. y of t is equal to delta of t minus 4 into e raised to minus 6t. Isn't it? And then substitute value of t is equal to 0 0.1 second, which is equal to. Now we know that delta of t. Is, is nothing but impulse which is having ideal impulse t is equal to 0 only it is having unity value so for t is equal to 0 0.1 second so delta 0.1 minus 4 e raised to minus 0 0.6 which is equal to 0 minus 4 e raised to minus 0 0.6 which is equal to minus 2.19 so option b is correct Option B is correct. So in that way you can apply the basic foundation. So what you need to do is that you need to understand basic fundamentals like Laplace transform, Z transform, their application and then you need to prepare for the other advanced fundamentals. So in this session I will stop here. You can revise the basic foundation, basic fundamentals and then prepare for the examinations. Try to avoid the negative marking. All the very best. Thank you very much.